What is up ninjas? Two videos ago we found the hacker's secret lair and on his computer we found a map. So we started following the map. So let's see where this map leads us, V. I think we'll find some cool hidden treasure or at the very least maybe we'll find out who the hacker is. All right, we are gonna go up this steep incline right here. Wow. Why is it so steep? You can do it, V. Whoa, check this out. Oh guys, it's a warning sign. That's creepy. Let's keep going. Oh man, not another deserty area again, V. Okay, I guess we just gotta start investigating this area and see what we can find. I think this is exactly where the map led because the map is showed like a very dusty, sandy area. But why do you think we're here though? Are we looking for the hacker right now? Or was the hacker looking for something? I'm not sure. Maybe there's something here that the hacker wanted. Whoa, whoa, wait a second. What's this? What? Chad, don't touch anything. Look at this. Oh. Wait, what is it? I've seen one of these before. It's a metal detector. You use this to look for like buried treasure underneath sand. It makes a noise when you find metal objects. How long has it been here? Look how dusty it is. Yeah. It's so dusty. Let me try turning it on here. Oh, okay. So as you find metal, it detects it right here. Let's, let's give this a test and see if it works. Hmm. Is it oh. supposed to be making a noise? I'm not hearing anything. Oh, oh wait, wait. wait, wait. Whoa. Definitely detecting something right here. Let's see what let's see what's underneath there. Oh, what is that? Oh, oh it's a oh another one. It's a glove. Wait a second. I think I've seen these gloves before. You have? These look really familiar. Guys, leave a comment down below if you recognize these gloves. I'm pretty sure we've seen these gloves before. So somebody was metal detecting here and then something must have happened to them. They just decided to leave suddenly. Why would they leave everything behind? Do you think they're still around here? Are they looking for their stuff or did something happen to these people? Yeah, I don't know. I, why would they just leave all their stuff here though? That's really suspicious. This just feels really dangerous. I really don't want to be here. Maybe we shouldn't do this at all. Don't worry V. I did bring ninja weapons with me right here in my CWC bag. Backpack. For you, I brought the bow staff. Some of these ninjas have never seen this bow staff before. Why don't you show them how it works? Whoa! Whoa. Yeah! Awesome! Woo. Turns into a full metal bow staff. Yeah! And then to protect myself, I brought nunchucks! Oh yeah, watch out. So no one is gonna be coming and messing with us, right V? Well somebody was definitely here metal detecting for a reason, so I think we should use this and see if we can find some buried treasure. Uh, I guess it's okay since I, you know, we have our ninja weapons with us, I feel a little more secure and safe, so I guess we can do it. Yeah, I don't think anything bad's gonna happen. I don't think anyone's around here. All right, well let's uh, start metal detecting here. Okay. Oh, what is this stuff? Whoa, it's not it's not metal. It looks like it's some sort of animal droppings. Is it is it it's poop? Oh. Oh. Is it is it pond monster poop? It really smells bad. Okay, let's oh my God. let's get out of oh, here. This is so oh. gross, Chad. Well, I think we're on the right path then because there's gotta be something buried under here. Let's just keep uh, using this metal detector. You don't wanna bring that poop, Chad? No thanks. I don't wanna have anything to do with that poop. Not finding anything yet. Oh! Whoa, check this out. It's going a little bit crazy right, right about here. here. Right here? It's getting, it's hitting the 10. Yeah, check it out right there. Let's see what's... Yeah. I don't see anything. Oh, wait. Oh, I... I hear something. What's under there? <gasps> Whoa. 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 It's a pair of binoculars. Oh, it's spy binoculars right there. Oh, it's got a bunch of buttons and dials on it. Whoa, it's like orange. When you look, I can see orange colors. Whoa. Orange. I can see really far and I see like an orange color. So it's like thermo. I'm seeing things based on their temperature, I think. Oh. I think that's how Here, it works. Check it. it out. Wow. Yeah. You see anything weird or interesting? No, not yet, but everything is like orange. Ninjas, let's have you guys take a look through these binoculars and see if you see anything interesting around here. All right, ninjas, tell me in the comments below if you see anything interesting or anything weird here. I'm looking along with you. Let me know if you see anything suspicious or out of the ordinary. Okay, I'm not seeing anything, but let me know if you guys see something. But well, let's get back to doing some metal detecting here. All right. Okay, it's been about 15 minutes. Haven't found anything else yet. I'm so thirsty, you guys. It's so hot out here. Oh, Whoa. what was that? Heard a beep. All right, let me just let me just yeah. take this up. Oh. It's definitely going off right here. Let's see what's underneath there. 
What? Oh. What is that? Oh, wait, careful. Is it an animal? Is it? Oh no, is it a dead animal? Is it a baby chicken? Looks like a baby chicken or something. Oh, don't touch it, Chen. Oh, wait a second. Ugh. It's a keychain. It's like a rubber. Oh. It's a rubber chicken keychain. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was real for a second. So it's like a toy or something. Check this out. Watch this. If you squeeze the rubber chicken, guys, it was an, weird. Egg, an egg comes out. Why is that so weird? Is there is there a clue in the egg? I don't know. Check it out. Isn't that weird? Oh. I don't see anything. Huh, okay, so just someone. <laughs> Will you keep getting dirt in your mouth? Yeah, because every time you push it, it just flies <laughs> right in my face. <laughs> so, what's kind of interesting about this is over on Marlin's video, the hacker made us slide through rubber chickens. Oh, yeah, you're right. Maybe this place does have something to do with the hacker after uh, all. I don't know. If I know there's got to be more here. Ugh, watch out for poop. Yeah, if the hacker was, was coming. What? Oh, right here. It's, I'm hearing something right here, B. Okay. Let's dig it up. Whoa. What is it? I know. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my gosh, is that a phone? Is this for real? Whose phone Whoa. is this? Does it turn on? I can't tell. It's super bright out here. Right, let's, let's go in the shade yeah. or something. Okay, we're in the shade now. Let's turn it on, see if you can see what's on there. Whoa. You guys, can you see this? There's a, the screen is a J. Can we unlock it? No. Huh, that's interesting that it's a J on there though. Whose phone could this be? Something with a J. Guys, leave a comment down below if you have an idea of whose phone this might be. I think their name probably starts with a J. Who huh. do you know that's name that starts with a J? Huh, Papa Jake? Could be Papa Jake's phone. That would be interesting. Both J Fred from ah, Team Edge. Team Edge, yeah. 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 His name is, starts with a J. Jake and Josh both start with a J. And then our good buddy Justin, we haven't seen him in so long. His name starts with a J and yeah. he, he's always losing his phone too. I know, he always loses his keys and his phones. I guess or... we'll see what these ninjas have to say in the comments, who they think it might be. Man, this is getting super exciting. We just found a phone. I mean, I feel like we're getting super close to finding the hacker or just something. Or something. Like, this is a huge clue right here. If we can crack open this phone, yeah. I feel like we know the true identity of the hacker. This is pretty exciting. We're finding so many cool things, V. I know. Whoa. What? Wait. Got something else, something else under here. Right here? Yep, yep, right there. Whoa, I see something. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Whoa, cool, a coin. Oh, there's more. Wait, that's not a coin. Whoa, it's a metal P. Yeah, interesting. Okay, guys, let's let's remember that there's a metal P here. This might be a clue for something we find later, oh. I hope. It could be a B too, Chad. Could be a B. Here's a, so I got a nickel, a penny. Oh, remember when we found all those pennies? We got all those pennies in that eBay mystery box in one of our older videos, V? Here's another one, right here. Nice. Oh, I wonder if any some of these coins are worth some money. That'd be so cool. These are like classic old coins that are valuable. Is this what the person was here looking for? I feel like these probably weren't what they were looking for. There's gotta be something more than this. More animal droppings, watch out for those. Uh. Could be pond monster droppings, I have no idea. Oh, do you think this thing works in grass or whatever know. this thing? We haven't tried it in the grass yet. Whoa, wait, I see something. Check this out. What is that? Careful. What is that a tool? What, what is that? Oh. oh, it looks like a speaker or a microphone or something. Oh, interesting. So on the back side of it right here, I see a little ch chipmunk or a squirrel right here. So let me give it a shot here. I'm going to push in this button and talk into it. Hello. How are you? Oh, weird. I sound like a chipmunk. <laughs> you kind of sound like me. <laughs> Hi, I sound like let, you. Let me see what, what I sound like. Hello? Oh my gosh. Where are you, Chad? <laughs> it's so high pitched. There's also other settings here. There's like an alien setting right here. Let's give this one a shot. Oh, whoa. Oh. Whoa. That's pretty scary. <laughs> There's all kinds of cool settings on here. Whoa, here's like a, that looks like a mystery man setting. A mystery man? Yeah, it's like a mysterious man. Let's see what that sounds like. Hello, Hello V. Whoa. How are you? No, don't say my name in that voice. This, I don't like it. This sounds really familiar. I feel like I've heard this voice before. Guys, leave a comment down below if you think you've heard this voice before. I I feel like I've heard this. Haven't you heard this before, V? It sounds familiar, but I can't remember where it's from. Test, test. I think I know where this is from, V, this what? voice. I think I figured it out, and I think, here, ch check this out. Chad, Chad and V, v in front of me are three caves. You recognize that? No. Yeah. Tarantula cave. Oh, so, something on the screen's popping up. Oh my god. Chad and V 
In front of me are three caves. Those gloves we found, these that's the hacker's gloves. That, now it all makes sense. The hacker used this to change his voice, and those gloves we You're saw. You're right, this is the exact same gloves. When the hacker was shuffling those caves things up. Oh my gosh, so is this the hacker's? So yeah, so the Did hacker, he leave this behind? The hacker must have been here with the metal detector. What and, was he looking for? And his gloves, I don't know. See, there must be something here he's either hiding or he's trying to find. Yeah, why would the hacker just leave that laying here? That's so weird. Do you think, do you think something happened to maybe, him? Maybe, maybe one of these ninjas found him and caught him and trapped him or something? Or maybe one of our friends, like the sharers or... Did he find something and like ran away? Maybe the pond monster grabbed him <gasps> or something? I don't know. All right, where's my ninja weapon? Let's okay. go. All right, I'm prepared. So it was kind of in this area where we found that metal letter. I feel like there's gotta be more clues in that area. Maybe that's what the hacker was looking for. Oh, oh heard a beep. Oh, there's definitely something something going on here. I hear some beeping. All right, move. Let's get digging, B. Oh, wait. Whoa. It looks like a, a metal D. Oh, wait. Oh. A metal A. Is there any more? Here's something. A metal W. Oh, another coin. A nickel. What else is right here. in here? Oh, nice. An R. Yeah, we're finding all kinds of metal letters here. This has got to spell something, or maybe it'll be like a password again, like we found before. Guys, leave a comment down below if you think these letters equal something. Is it a password? Is it a combination? Does it spell out something? Maybe it's the hacker's first name. Interesting. Well, I thought his name might be Zargo or something, but oh. maybe that maybe that was just his computer's password. I don't know. Okay, there's nothing else here. Let's let's keep let's keep looking. There's this can't be what the hacker was here looking for. There's got to be more. Oh man, we've been out here for like an hour at this point now. God, my hair is like just so crazy right now. So sweaty. I'm ready to give up, but my I feel like there's got to be something important down here. My feet hurt so much. There's all these dang grass all over. Yeah, Look, they're it's stuck. They're, they're stuck, stuck in into, your foot. Yeah, it's poking me. Now I noticed a lot of you ninjas were saying that you thought you saw something in these bushes over here when we had the binoculars. So I think we should investigate these bushes here, V. These leaves are really prickly. Check these out. They're like super sharp leaves. Are they used for protection or something? Yeah. You know, like instead Ooh. of barbed wire, they're using these? Yeah. Like this would be a place where I would want to hide something valuable so people don't come in here because it's too sharp. These guys said they saw something back here. That, that would make a lot of sense. Let me get the metal detector in here. Okay. Whoa, whoa, it's going off pretty good over here. Like way back here, it's going off a lot. Wow, there must be something back there. Oh, I guess that's a cue for me. Some crawling space that's small. Watch out for the sharp leaves, Oh. Please. Ah, ow. Okay, let me see, I'm gonna hold these branches up for you here. Oh, thanks. Oh, they are super sharp on my ow. fingers. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, do you guys hear that? Whoa. Yeah, what is that? Sounds like, a, sounds like wood or something. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me pull it out. Ow! Oh, sharp? Yes. Oh, it's heavy. Ah. Ah. Really heavy, huh? Yes. Chet, help me. Hold on. Uh, ah. Oh, wow, that is heavy. Uh, ouch. Oh, it's super sharp. Ah. Okay. Here, get out of there, V. Oh my gosh. Why is it so heavy? Oh. Whoa, what is this? Let me lift it up, bring it into the light here. Oh. Whoa, check this out, guys. Holy cow, look what we found. This is so cool. Is this what the hacker has been hiding or is this what he's trying to look for? He must have been looking for this and that's why he had a metal detector here. Oh, so you don't think he was trying to hide this treasure from us or from anyone? I bet you he was trying to find this treasure. That's my guess. Whoa, I'm wondering what's in here. There's a padlock on here. Oh. Sorry, okay. V. <laughs> Blowing dust in your face. <laughs> Oh, interesting. Check it out, guys. This padlock here. It's got letters and maybe some numbers on it. This is so cool that we found a freaking treasure chest. This I hope it's a treasure chest. I mean, it's pretty exciting, that's but... That's true. It could be something bad inside or it could be something good. I have no idea. You never know with this hacker guy. Let's try to open this up. I've got my ninja weapon. Let's see if we can open this up. I'm going to get my nunchucks out and see if I can open up this safe. V, I need you to watch my back because right. I feel like someone might be watching us. Okay. Okay. And they're gonna try to snatch this chest from us. So let's, All right. You got my back, Lee? Yes, I got it. All right, let's open up this treasure chest right here. Oh, uh, yeah. Whoa. Whoa. yeah. Oh. It's not even tempting. Wow, this is a strong treasure chest. That's not working. I think we're gonna have to take it home 
we're gonna have to try to figure out how to open up that padlock. Yeah, let's bring this home, Chad, because we have more ninja weapons, and I have my spy gear with me, and we can definitely get this open if we bring it home. We're gonna try and unlock this and see what's inside. And the way we found this chest was really, really creepy and really suspicious. Like, it might be haunted. You guys know that I don't like supernatural stuff or ghosts, so I always carry my trusty ghost meter with me, and we are going to find out if this is haunted. You ready, Chad? Ready. Oh, nothing yet. Nothing yet. Oh. oh. Whoa. Right here above the treasure Oh my gosh. It's, it's getting, getting faster. faster. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, the oh lights just went out. What? Oh, no. oh gosh, it's so dark in here, I Chad. Know, what do we do? Oh, Whoa. that's really bright. That was really weird that the light turned out right as the ghost meter was blowing up. Do you think it blew off the fuse? Maybe. We should go check the breaker fuse. Okay, it's right down here. I do see that there is one switch there that got flipped. So I don't know how that got flipped right as the ghost meter was going off. That's really weird. So I'm gonna flip it back over. But no mm -hmm. lights went on in the house. No, it's still super dark. Should we not open that box? I don't want to unleash any like creepy, scary spirits in our house. Guys, give this video a thumbs up if you want us to open that box anyway. I don't know, we're pretty freaked out. A lot of you guys have gave this video a thumbs up, so I guess we'll have to do it. You want to start opening this, Chad? Well, we have to figure out how to get this lock unlocked first. Oh, there goes my phone. Oh, there, there okay. Go. I thought maybe your phone got possessed too. <laughs> Check this lock out, guys. We have to figure out how to unlock this. Now, a lot of you in the last video were commenting that we found some metal letters and you think that that is what's gonna open this padlock right here. And I got the letters right here and I, I have a feeling you guys are right. You guys are so smart about all this stuff. I'm just gonna lay it down here for you guys. A lot of you were guessing what this spelled out. Leave a comment below if you think you know what this spells. D-P-R-M-A, but we have, you know, you gotta rearrange it to make it spell something. And I feel like this can be an M or a W. I think it spells rap, rap, mm. rap. Food. Nope, never mind. Oh, raw. Raw. <laughs> raw PD. Raw PD. I think if this is an M, then it'll be map. M-A-P. -P. Map drive. I'm seeing a lot of comments right now. People are saying warp D. D. I don't know if, what that means. Like if, if that's a video game reference, like a warp zone. Oh, it could be a YouTuber that we've never heard of before. Why don't we try warp D on this lock in the front here? All right, I'm going to try warped. Here's W A. a. It's an R. R, P, P, and D. Warp D, come on! <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Sweet! Wow, you guys are so good at this! Yeah, thanks guys for the Warp D. So now, it's time to open this treasure chest up. Here we go! Dun dun dun! What the heck? This is weird. This doesn't look like a treasure chest at all. It just looks like a bunch of random stuff. Looks like a toy chest to me. Is the hacker a child? Definitely a really cute looking bunny. Yeah, he least. looks so sweet. His hands are stuck together. Hmm. Oh, look at his cute little yeah, ears. He's so cute. He's so, look, look at his, his eyes. eyes. They're so, so sweet. Cute. Ah! Whoa. Oh my gosh, what, what is happened? What is with this thing? Cute, scary, cute, scary. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what a weird toy. He gets scary looking as you squeeze the sides of his head here. Oh no. Oh, so deceiving. Yeah. So I wonder if the hacker is like a really sweet, innocent looking person, but really. But inside, inside. he's scary. Is this bunny possessed? You got your ghost meter? <laughs> she just threw it. Let's see what else is in here. Okay, what else? Oh, what's hmm, this? That's looking. really scary looking. What is that? It's got eyes and a mouth. What does it do? Oh, is it? Can you put stuff in his mouth? We found those coins, Chad, at yeah. the, in the desert. Do you think, are we supposed to put this in here? Maybe. It looks, doesn't look like coins would fit in his mouth. It does kind of look like that. Let me, uh, I think I put those in my pocket. Hang on one second here. <gasps> oh, ooh, oh, oh my gosh. That's creepy. Look how realistic that looks. <laughs> Oh, oh, no, he stopped. Stops. How can I get that out? Whoa. Oh. Now feed him again. Whoa. Ah. Oh, he spit it out. He doesn't like pennies. He wants bigger coins. Ah. <laughs> ah. Ah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh <my laughs> I fooled gosh. you. Why don't we try to get those coins out now? There's got to be huh. a way to open this. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, what? Whoa. 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 Oh, bugs. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Wait, are they, are moving? Sure? Are they moving? They look like they're moving. Oh, my gosh. Oh. 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 
Oh, that was just my breath. Okay, I think they're just plastic bugs. Let's get these bugs out of uh, here. How about you open something now? Because I'm kind of creeped out. Okay, what is this? Looks like a nest with some eggs in it. Whoa. Uh, is it really? I'm kind of afraid to touch it. They're really hard. Guys, what do you think these eggs are? I remember that uh, the sharers found some eggs and they thought it was the pond monster's eggs. I wonder if the hacker was looking for these. Maybe these are the pond monster eggs? And he wanted to put the eggs in the sharer's pond maybe oh. and mess with them. What should we do with these now? Yeah, I mean, uh, maybe we could grow, turn them into like good pond monsters. Yeah, if we raise them correctly and then love them and give them all the nurturing that they need, maybe they'll just be nice monsters. Maybe we should put them in the freezer for now until we figure out what to do with them. Like cryogenic? Like to freeze yes. the process of yeah, like growing? And then we can unthaw them whenever we're ready to grow them. I'll go do that right now. Okay, I'm back. What else we got in this treasure chest? Be? It's really big. Is it a brick? Is it a brick or something? Okay, it says dig it out. So we have to dig something out of this white brick? It looks like it. Is this what? gonna be more Pond Monster eggs inside of this thing or what? I don't know what we're gonna dig this out with. We could go get some ninja weapons. Let's go get some then. Okay, cool, let's do it. John, I think I know the exact weapon to use for this. Yeah? Yeah. You guys know I like all the little mini cute little weapons. Oh, it's right here. Look how cute this is. It's and a total V-size blade. It is. Here's a There's slightly bigger one, so for Chad. All right, I think this is actually be really perfect for it. Let's go dig that out. Here you go, Chad. You can have this one. So what do we do? We just dig into this thing now? Scrape it off? Saw it in half? Hey, yeah! Hey, yeah! Hey, yeah! All right, guys, we've been here for like 15, 20 minutes, and this is how far we've gotten. I feel like we should just break this thing open. Do you want to break it in half, or should I break it in half? I think I can break it in half. Okay. Get ready here. Stretch those hands out. Yeah. Three, two, one. Snap it! Ah! Oh! Wow! Whoa! There's a skeleton in here. Oh my gosh! Wow! Look at all this. Is this a pond monster skeleton? Look at this. Why, Whoa. Was, why was it fossilized in this rock? That's so crazy. I wonder if the hacker was looking for this. Is he gonna get like the DNA out of these out of the skeleton and try to grow his own? Kind of like Jurassic Park? I wonder. Yeah, he has yeah. the eggs and then yeah. the skeleton. And, he was, and then like he, he's gonna crossbreed it with yeah, the DNA. Right. What is what was this? Whoa. Was that in there? There's a set of keys here. Why is there a set of keys? with a skeleton. Did whatever this is swallow it? And then maybe this key unlocks something. We've got to keep these keys in a safe spot because the hacker is probably going to be looking for these. Chad, do you think we should preserve this guy and like try to put him together? Uh, maybe, maybe we should. I feel like we need an expert for this. Guys, comment down below if you know any YouTubers who are like dinosaur experts or bone experts. Yeah, and they can help us out with this. We'll save this, wrap it all up here, and let's see what else is in our treasure chest, huh? Huh. Tuna can? Oh, is this like food? Should we just open it? Sure. It's what? like, it's probably expired. Oh, okay. Oh, ah! What is that? Ah! Oh, oh! <laughs> Gross! It's a tarantula! Look at the tin can. Remember when we had to go through those caves? Yes. And it was like, if you go through the wrong cave, you have to eat a tarantula. A tarantula? This what he was talking about, that uh, we had to eat one of these. It smells so bad, you guys. Do you think this is what the hacker's looking for now? Is this his treasure chest? Right, you guys, comment below right now if you think this treasure chest belongs to the hacker. I kind of think the hacker was actually looking for this treasure chest and wanted to find what was inside of it. And then he went missing. That's what I think happened. Oh, really? Yeah. Gosh, this is such a huge, big mystery. I want to get rid of this tarantula chat because it smells yeah. so bad. Okay, let's wrap it up in this paper towel here and throw it in the garbage. Ugh. Oh my gosh, there's a lot. Let's wrap it why up. Why am I Th doing this? Throw it in the garbage. Why am I doing this? Don't let it spill. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Why am I touching this? Ew, 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 ew. Okay. Okay, let's see what else is in here. Oh. oh, I recognize that. It's part of a Ouija board, right? But you, where's like the rest of the board? This is the only yeah. thing that was in it. So you, people, will put, they put their hands on this and then it moves by itself to spell out words or to answer questions. It's really, really creepy. It's like a triangle. 
Yeah. Yeah, like we've never... Have we seen that before? Wait, did, what was... Did you just feel something behind us? I thought I felt something. Huh. huh. That was weird. Yeah, just, you know, like... like. Whoa! Like, did that just fly out of your hands, did, or did you throw it at me? No, it just flew out of my hand. <laughs> I don't know, but like, like the hair in the back of my neck just started standing up, so I was just kind of like, it was just really weird. Did you see something move behind us? Let us know. Are we supposed to do something with that, or what should we do? I'm not sure, but there, there's no board on it, so. Yeah, so maybe we just hang on to that. Maybe that'll come in handy later. And let's see what else is in here. What is oh. that? A little tiny toy? Oh, I've never had one of these when I was a kid, but I remember seeing these. You pretend to vacuum when you're a little kid with it. You push it and it pops up. Look, it actually works. That is pretty cool. Remember when we saw the little tiny pond monster? And the, the little kitchen set? Yeah. In his house? Why are there like a bunch of little things? Does this person like shrink people down to really small sizes? Yeah, because that fossil was really small too. Well, another thing to add to our collection of weird things we're finding today. There's okay. something I haven't seen for a really long time, a cassette tape. I bet you most of you viewers have probably never even seen one of these. So that's a cassette tape. People from the 1980s used to listen to music from these. I listen like on my iPod and stuff. I don't even like know how to use this, Chad. You know how to use this? Oh yeah, I know how to use it. So where can we listen to this? I don't even know if I have a cassette player. Wait a second, in my old car, I think there's a cassette player and a CD player in there. We could try to listen to this in my car. Maybe there's music, maybe there's a secret message, I don't know. Let's find this out. Yeah, let's go give it a listen. All right, guys, we are in Chad's car right now, and we have this cassette tape. And I do have a cassette tape player right up here. Go ahead, V, stick that cassette tape in there. All right, the cassette is in there. Let's go ahead and hit play. What? What was that? That was super weird. Guys, what was that? That was not even in English. I don't even know what language that was. Man, we are going to need you guys' help to figure out what this is. Guys, leave a comment down below if you think you know what this is or what it means. Let's listen to it again here. That is so weird. It sounds like this person's pretty stressed out. Yeah, yeah. it sounds like they're in trouble or something. Yeah. All right, we're gonna figure out what this message says, guys. V's got the recording on her phone. I pulled up Google Translate on my phone here. And so I've put in Welsh, and we're gonna try to translate Welsh to English. So guys, listen to this as well. Help us out, leave a comment below with what you hear this voice saying, and I'll type it in. Zels Nishnin. It sounded like total gibberish to me, but I tried my best. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit translate here. Funny dog food support. What? That does not make any sense. I noticed that somebody else had recommended it sounds Russian. I'm gonna try going to Russian. I'm gonna hit the microphone and then V will hit play on her phone. <laughs> Okay, there it is. It says Ulin Fliegen. Huh, it didn't seem to work. Okay, so maybe it's not Russian. Yeah, I mean, it might not even be human. You know, some of you guys actually commented that it might be a ghost. So let's hmm. try that out. What does a ghost sound like, Chad? I'm gonna do a search on YouTube for what does a ghost sound like? That's pretty scary. It does sound kind of similar. Hey, V, um, remember when we were digging in the desert with the metal detector, we found this. Oh yeah, it had like all these switches. Yeah, it has all these different settings. So there's like a squirrel setting, there's a mystery man setting, there's a ghost setting, yeah. So the way this works is you manually pull this right here and then you talk into this end and it'll make you sound like a ghost. So maybe if we play this through this, it'll we'll sound- We'll understand it. Yeah. Huh, that did not work at all. No, it actually sounds like a chipmunk. It sounded worse, yeah. Man, we've gotta figure out what this message means, guys. If you have any ideas, leave a comment below. There's gotta be a reason why this was buried in the desert. Like, did the hacker leave it there? We don't know. Because we did find the hacker's gloves, and they were next to a metal detector, so it looked like he left in a hurry. Maybe we should use some spy gadgets to decipher this message. Yeah, yeah, we have a bunch of those here. So I've got this micro super ear. You attach this to your own ear, and it allows you to hear things 
things louder and more clearly. All right, so give it a give it a play V, and I'm gonna give it a listen here with the spy gadget. Whoa! I hear I hear like a person kind of talking quietly underneath this whole message. That's really weird. It was like there was like a person underneath all the static talking. So were they like in the background? Yeah, like it was like like this. Yeah, and it sounded like it was sped up or something as oh, well. Oh, that's really interesting, Chad, because some of you guys actually left a comment on my Instagram and you guys said that to listen to it slower. So oh. maybe maybe we need to do that. You guys are really smart about stuff like that. Let's go into my recording studio and we'll slow the message down. I've got the audio put into Pro Tools here. This is an advanced audio editing software. A lot of spies use it to figure out secret messages. All right, so we're gonna slow the tempo down from 100% down to 50%. It sounded like he said, they're coming. Let me try to apply some filters to this and we'll see if we can filter out some of the background noise and really isolate the voice. What, what was that? Okay, that was really weird because there's like one part of the recording where like the hairs on the back of my neck started straightening up again. I'm gonna apply some more filters because uh, there, there was definitely something weird in the background. I'm gonna see if I can isolate that. Guys, listen to this sound. It is super weird. I've isolated it really well. What is this noise, guys? Did you hear that? Oh my gosh, that just gave me the chills, Chad. Yeah, it was like a high pitch, like something moving by. It was really weird. I got the same feeling when we found the treasure box, but when we were unboxing it, I felt the same chill. That's right, I, I remember I was like, I felt like someone walked behind me or something. Yeah, and like, like the hair, the hair on the back of my neck definitely stood up. I don't know if we're supposed to find this cassette tape anymore. Is this cassette tape haunted or something? Well, Chad, there are so many ninjas out there on your video and my video telling us to play it backwards. Oh, yeah, that's a good to idea. like reverse it, maybe huh. you know. Yeah, I didn't even think of that. So you guys are so smart. All right, so I'm gonna use this plugin called Reverse. There's a little button right here that says Reverse, and then I just need to click Render here. Let's give it a listen. Help! 34 degrees north, 118 <gasps> degrees west. This is John. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh, you guys are right! That was totally in English. We can Whoa. understand everything super clearly. Yeah, he said help! Let's listen to it again. Let me turn the volume up a little bit. Help! 34 degrees north, 118 degrees west. This is John. What? We gotta write this down. Yeah, what? Okay, let me write this down. He said, what is, he said help! And then there's a bunch of numbers. Help! And then he said, 34 degrees north. 34 degrees north. 118 degrees west. 118 degrees west. This is Ju. They said, This the, is Ju. This is Ju. Oh my so gosh. It's somebody who needs help. It sounds like their name starts with a J. Remember we found that letter J? Yeah, and it was on the phone too. Yeah, we found a phone buried underneath the sand with the metal detector. Oh my god. J was on the phone. So maybe this person is running away from the hacker. The hacker is doing something to this person. Oh my gosh. Well, we need to figure this out. Yeah. Who's this J person? Guys, leave a comment down below who you think this person is who left the message. Someone whose name that starts with a J. Mm -hmm. Leave comments down below. I think we should call some people who we know that start with a J. Yeah. And see if they're in trouble. Huh. A lot of you guys had left a comment that says Papa Jake. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give him a call right now and see if he's in trouble. Or, or if he's the hacker. Yeah. Well, gosh. Can we trust what he says? I don't know. Let's see what he has to say. Let me give him a call here. Mm -hmm. There we go. It's ringing. Hello? Is this Papa Jake? Can you hear me? Hey, how's it going? It's Chad Wild Clay. Oh, and V. And I'm v. here too. Yeah. <laughs> hey, so in our video here, we just found a, a cassette tape that had a scrambled message on it, and it said, "This is J." And we thought maybe this is Papa Jake. Are you? Are you like? Are you? Are you in some kind of trouble or anything? Uh, I am. You are. You are. I'm locked in a prison underwater. You are. Dude, <laughs> do you know who put you in there? I have no idea, but I've been down here for quite some time now. Whoa, dude. Yeah, because there's a there's like a hacker messing with us, and we thought that maybe this hacker was you. Well, can you prove that you've been underwater for a long time, or like how do we know that you're not tricking us? Uh, that's a good question. 
I 100% am not tricking you because if you check my videos, I've been under here, but there is an AI that I've been talking to. Oh. Maybe that could be the hacker. So an artificial intelligence has been communicating with you, and maybe that's the hacker you said? Yeah, it could be. I mean, he's controlling this whole thing down here. He controls the prison, so maybe he has access to all of our devices, and maybe that's how he found out where I live. Papa Jake, was that you on the cassette tape recording, needing help? C cassette tape? I, I don't even know what that is. No, I've, I've never had a cassette tape. Look, I'm the one that's in trouble here, but I'm underwater. I didn't record anything. Oh. oh. Okay, so he's not the one on the on the cassette then. All right, well, let me know what happens, guys. Maybe you can send me some plans on how to build a submarine because I'm a little lost down here. Thanks, Papa right, Jake. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Really appreciate it. Guys, comment down below who else you want us to call, who might be in help, who might be the hacker. And we also have to figure out what these numbers mean. You wrote those numbers down, V. I don't know what it means. I mean, I know there's like a, a 95 or 85 uh, degree bakery. So it's like a temperature because, yeah, he did say 34 degrees. So is that like the temperature where he's at? 34 degrees is pretty cold. That could be Minnesota where we're from. Oh. It's almost cold enough to snow. Yeah, yeah. And what was the other temperature? 118 degrees west. 118 degrees. That's super hot. That's like in the desert. Yeah, I mean, I don't even know if humans can survive. Huh. Gosh, guys, help us figure this out. What do these numbers mean? We need to figure that out. I think that's the next biggest clue to mm -hmm. figure out where this person is or mm -hmm. who this person is. If they're in like a cold climate or a hot climate, climate next to the word degrees it did say north oh. so it's like a direction so is that like how far you have to travel north to find this person oh interesting what if i just type it into google and see what comes up 34 degrees north 118 degrees west whoa it says los angeles county california let me click into this Oh, Google Earth. It's bringing us to a location. It says, oh snap, Google Earth isn't supported by your browser. Oh man, okay, I think we, we gotta find a different computer where, where this will work. All right, let's get my laptop. All right guys, I am back with my laptop here. You got Google Earth open? Yep, all right, uh, are you ready? Yep, I'm ready. Let's see where this location is here. Here it comes, there's the United States right there. Looks like it's going into California. Whoa! Zoom out. Whoa, look at this. Oh my gosh. It's a triangle place. That is creepy. These are the coordinates that were on the cassette tape. The person who needs help must be here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I think this is where we need to go, Chad. We need to help this person. Yeah, whoever it is, their name starts with a J. They need help. They're at this location in the middle of this triangle. Oh my gosh, we better bring a ton of ninja weapons. Yeah, we better. We've been driving for about 30 minutes, guys, and we've reached this area that's really deserted now. We see some, like a red barn. It looks totally like a deserted town. I'm not sure exactly what this place is. Looks like a ghost town. Kind of worried that they would be here because they'd be here all by themselves and I, this is kind of a weird place to be. How would they even get here? It's creepy Whoa. little shack in the left here. Yeah, that is creepy. We're like in the middle of all these mountains. Whoa. Oh, there's a gate. I don't think I can get through. Are we here? Let me check the map. All right, so we're this red arrow here. We need to get to this blue dot. So I think that's just about 20, 30 feet ahead. Okay. Um, so we just have a little bit further to go. I'm gonna jump outside and see if I can open up that gate. Yeah, I'm gonna check it out. We've got all of these padlocks right here. What? There's like five or six of them. What, there's too many locks and here, the combination. Yeah, so we'll never be able to drive through here with our Tesla. So I think what we're gonna have to do is just jump this fence and, and try to find who this person who left the tape is. Go ahead, Chad. You could probably just crawl underneath, V. <laughs> yeah. That was really difficult. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, there's like a whole abandoned town right here. It's a really old town, established in 1876. It says welcome, but it doesn't look very welcoming here. This gate is completely locked. There's a lock right here. Oh, V, remember we found those keys in that treasure chest? Why don't we try those keys here? Yeah, I did bring them with me. Do you want to try it here? Oh, oh, whoa, it goes in. Check this out. Okay, nope, that doesn't turn. Oh, it went all the way in there. Let me try this other one here. No, that one doesn't fit in there. I think we're gonna have to jump the fence. Guys, give this video a thumbs up if you want us to jump the fence and go into this abandoned town. They're giving us a lot of thumbs up, V. I guess they want us to jump the fence. You should do it. All right, watch out. You guys, one of the many benefits of being small is that I can just walk right through it. You can walk through it? Oh, yeah. crawl through it, I see. I thought you were gonna like go through it like Invisible Girl. Look at this barn right here. It's huge. But what I noticed right away is that, look at that window up there. Like it's broken. 
Like yeah. someone was trying to break in already. I think we should try and see what's in there. Maybe the person we're looking for is in there. Oh, there's so many bugs all over here. What is this right here, Chad? It's a horse saddle, I think. Oh, it looks so old. Do you think it's from 1876? Maybe this is like a lever, and if you ride it, it'll open up the barn. Whoa, you hear that? I heard something. I don't see any doors opening. Oh, it's a lock though. Yeah, it was a locked door. Padlock oh. though, combination. Bunch of numbers here. Okay, I guess we'll have to keep our eye out for any numbers that we come across here. Yeah. What was the year again? It was like 1876. 1876? I'm just gonna just try, try it. Try that. Quick. Okay, so this is upside down. So I'm gonna try 18. One, eight, eight seven, seven, 1876. Uh, Must no. be another number. That's weird. That's very weird. Hmm. HP. It says HP on it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't what, even know what this is. What is this thing? Is it like a fire hydrant or something? Whoa, look at this. It says Jones right there. Remember in the cassette, Chad? It says J. This is this is J. Were they saying this is Jones? Jones? That's a name that starts with a J. Could that be the hacker or? Is this where the person who left the cassette lives? Maybe it's their first name. We don't know any Jones though. Or last name Jones. Huh, this could be a clue. Okay, Jones. Keep, keep that in mind, you guys. We'll continue on and see what else we can find. Gosh, there's another barn. I think it's a rooster barn? Look at this, yeah. Roosters must live in here or something? I hope the person we're looking for is in here. When I open this door, let's see if a bunch of roosters fly out. Empty. Should have known it was abandoned, just like everything else around here. It's really dark in here. Oh, super dark. What is in here? Let's see, looking for clues. It's like a chicken coop, I it's, think. <laughs> it's really dusty. <laughs> no chickens out there? No chickens. No okay. roosters. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else in here, so I think Oh, jeez. Jeez. Oh, Gosh. What is this thing? It's like a trash can lid, or? Oh, maybe oh. this leads to like a secret hatch. Ooh, I wonder what's under here. Let's see. Whoa! It's rocks and they spell HP. Leave a comment down below if you think you know what HP means. What do you think HP means? Harry Potter? That's the first thing that came to my mind. Do you think this is the initials of the hacker? Maybe the hacker's name is like Harry or Henry. Gosh, I feel like I've seen this HP before. Like, like didn't yeah. we just see? Do you that, guys remember that? On that Jones thing out there, I think that said HP on it. Did it? So why would there be an HP here? I think we should go check that out again. Oh my gosh, let's go. Let's see. Jones. Yeah, yeah, right here. It says Where? HP, there's an HP right here on this. So there, this must be some sort of clue or something. Whoever wrote that in the shed must have wanted us to find this right here, this HP. Wait, Is this, wait. do you hear that? There's a dog barking somewhere. There's a dog here somewhere. I hear it barking, but I don't see it. Where is it? Oh, should we hide? Is someone gonna find us here? Okay, you guys, Whoa. this thing twists here. Okay. Whoa. Oh! Whoa! Look at that. Oh my gosh. What is that? There's a note in here. It says, My beard is getting long. If you have a razor, bring it to the abandoned house. Who would have written this? Someone with a beard. Who do, who do we know that has a beard? Guys, leave a comment down below if you think you know someone that we know who has a beard. I feel like there's a ton of abandoned houses over here, so we gotta yeah. find the exact one this person's in. It's kind of exciting because we know at least they're here, so we can actually save them now. Do we have a razor? No, we don't have a razor. Huh. I don't shave. I did not bring a razor with me. I should have thought of that. Let's just hurry up. All right, let's go. It's our lucky day, a Pepsi machine. This video is not sponsored by Pepsi, by the way. We seriously just found this right here. Do you think there's any, even anything in it? It actually looks like it's totally broken. Then here's the dollar slot. It's completely broken. But wait, yeah. this town is from the 1800s. They didn't yeah. have Pepsi machines back then. This must be newer. It felt like no one's used this for a very long time. I wonder if there's any clues in this oh, thing. Oh, careful, there might be glass. Oh, oh my gosh! I'm just kidding, V. <laughs> it's too easy to scare you, V. I want to leave now. Wait, what? Is this a clue right here? Pack 612. Huh. Den 3. 612. It's a phone number from Minnesota. Because we're both from Minnesota. Gosh, it must be someone we know who's leaving all these notes and clues and who's living here maybe. Okay, I'm gonna write that down. Uh, we'll keep exploring, looking for more clues. All right, guys, we just got into this house here. It's huge. It doesn't look abandoned. So we're gonna see who lives in there right now. Yeah, it looks freshly painted. There might be someone living here. I don't know. Maybe we should be a little quiet or something. Yeah. Maybe the hacker lives here. 
Whoa. All right, this definitely looks abandoned. Check this out, guys. There's no furniture in there. Yeah, it's totally yeah, empty. Yeah, and look how dusty the floors are. It just looks like it's been empty for a very long time. I'm actually gonna try the keys out here to see if we can get in. It's oh, tight. it's not even the right type of keys. It's like old skeleton keys. Yeah, we don't have those. These are like new keys. How old is this house? Maybe there's another door or something. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys, look over here. Whoa. Look at that staircase in the back there. We need to figure out how to get in there and get up those stairs. The doorway looks really huge, like giants live here or something. And look at the wallpaper over to the left over there. Whoa! <gasps> Whoa. 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 What, what was, was that? It? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, who is it? Is there anyone there? Wait, did you guys see anything? I like saw something in the window. Did you see something, Chad? Yeah, I saw something move. I saw someone right here in this window. You guys, comment down below if you saw something in the window. Let me know right now. That's really, really creepy. Whoa! Look at this. Why is this chair moving? Ah, oh, that looks so scary. Gosh, I wish I had my ghost meter here. Is someone sitting on there? Is someone sitting on there right now? Oh my gosh, I don't want to walk by there. I don't want to walk by it. But I, I think you should go first, Chad. Then the brave one, aren't you? No, you're not. I'm going to sneak by it really quietly. Be careful, Chad. Watch out! Oh my god! Why did that just move by itself? Are you trapped in there? No. How did this close by itself? I, I don't want to go in. What's in there? Ooh, a door. So I'm just going to toss you the keys. Try it. Catch. Wait. It's a padlock. It's a combination lock. It's more numbers again. I haven't found any other numbers, so I don't know what numbers to put in here. Do we try that 1876 again, you guys? Let's just try it. One, eight, seven, six. There's one. No. No. Whoa, B, look at this. Oh my god. It's a hatch. Chad, be very careful. Oh, it's sealed somehow. Here, let's try it. There's one, two, three. Ah! No, it must be <gasps> nailed down or something. Oh. oh man, I wonder what's in there. Trash. There's a really old fridge. Hmm, huh, nothing. Nope, nothing in here. Is there anyone sitting on this chair? Oh, it smells. Oh. oh. <laughs> I wonder if there's anyone sitting on this chair right now. A ghost? Yeah, it looks really creepy. What's that door behind you? There's no handle or anything. Huh, I think we should go look in the windows and see if we can figure out a way to get in. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's another house over there. Whoa! That must be the abandoned house, not this one. That's oh. where we're supposed to be. Yeah, that's where, oh my gosh, let's go, let's go. This has gotta be it. Oh my gosh. Oh, so scary. Safe, safer route right here, just walking in. Another chair! I wish I had my ghost meter with me, like, is someone sitting there? This is definitely abandoned. The flooring is like falling apart. If you step on it, it's gonna break. Oh man, I hope we don't fall through the floor. <laughs> oh, it's really dusty in here. Oh gosh. Wow, this is definitely abandoned. Hello? Anybody in here? Jones? Mr. Jones? HP? Mr. Jones! Oh my gosh. Be really careful. Look at the walls, they're falling apart. Oh. Why is there hay in a house? Yeah, it looks like a living room because of like the wallpaper. Yeah. But then there's like hay. Is like this... are, are there animals living here or? Or is this their furniture? Wow. What's this thing over here? Oh. Do you think it's like the bathroom? Is that what people used in the 1876? Because it, it does kind of smell. It's wet and musty. Ugh. Ugh. You think someone's been living here? I would sure hate to live here. What is with all the chairs? Why are there just random chairs everywhere? I just feel really creepy when I see an empty chair. Oh. A torn off headband. I didn't know Jay was a girl. That, it's a pink headband. Does it stand for Jenny then? Wait a second though, they said that they had a beard though. So it can't be a girl if they have a beard. Oh, this is confusing. Well, we've been looking around here for like half an hour and haven't yeah. found anything. Let's yeah, just leave. Yeah, let's get out of here. I don't think we're gonna find Jay in here. Whoa, Jeez. Care careful of these. God, Jeez. it's so slippery, these hay things. Glad you landed in some soft hay though. Oh, God, Jeez. it's slipping. What are you doing? Oh hey. gosh, wait, what is this? What is that? They're like tally marks. Whoa, and it, look, there's a J there. What does this mean? Do you think it's been like days that this person's been here? Yeah, a lot of times when you see these tally marks, someone's marking off how many days they've lived here. Could be hours or it could be months. Was Jay 
sleeping here? Yeah, like, whoever the J person was was sleeping on the hay, maybe? I mean, I would sleep on here if I was living in here. Because it's actually nice and soft. Yeah, there's nowhere else to sleep in here for sure. It's, how do we not see this before? There's like a oven in or something. <gasps> Whoa! What? Why is a CWC hat in here? Oh my gosh, is it a fan? Is so, Jay a fan? So whoever Jay is, they must have had a CWC hat. They have a beard. They've been living here for a number of days or hours. This it's bottle actually looks like really new and fresh. We must have just missed them. Do you guys have an idea who it is? I mean, Jay, CWC hat, and a beard. Who could that be? We're gonna head back to the Tesla first to grab some ninja weapons. I always bring ninja weapons with me. They're right here in the Tesla V. Let's go get them. It's my Tesla, just a reminder, you guys. Oh yeah, your Tesla. There we go. Let's get some ninja weapons. Always got to bring ninja weapons with you. I got my little blade right here, dragon blade. Here you go, V. And I've got two big ninja swords right here. One for me and one for V. Got the rainbow blade. Check that baby out. Hold that for me, V. And I've got this one as well. This is more of a V-size blade right <laughs> here. Just so we're prepared if anyone tries to jump us while we're exploring the abandoned town. All right, V, if you'd put these in my backpack, please. Yeah, who do you think this hacker is, Chad? Well, all I know is that their name starts with a J and they have a beard. They had a CWC hat with them, so they must know who we are, yeah. All right, let's go try to find this J person in this abandoned town. Oh, yes, a hose with water. I'm so thirsty, whoa. Whoa! Whoa! It shot really far. Oh my gosh! Here, V. Water fountain! Three, two, one, shoot! <laughs> oh my gosh! Why is that water fountain shoot so far? I got myself wet too! Uh -huh. <laughs> How can you drink out of this thing? Check it out. You're gonna shoot your face off. Okay, I'm gonna try. Watch this. Oh! oh! <laughs> it's like a fire hose, it's so fast. Oh, does it taste like underground water? Actually, that water feels pretty good because it's so hot out here right now. Yeah, it is uh, really hot, but I don't know. I feel like we should get a hat or something. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Why don't we go back to the Tesla and I, got, I love that CWC hat that we found in there. I'll wear that. All right, cool. cool. Yeah, I don't want to get a sunburn like I did last time when we did the slip and slide. Yeah. I got so sunburned. You were like super red like a tomato. I was peeling like crazy. There we go. I'm so glad this J person left this hat behind us. All right, back to exploring. Yep. Huh, wait a second. I think I see something of interest through here. Check this out. And look at what I found. The motorcycle. Wow. Let's see if I even fit on this thing. Oh, it's got really bouncy shocks. Oh, remember those keys we found in the treasure chest, V? Yeah, I have them right here. You do? Oh, yeah. Let's. I bet you this is what these keys are for. What? 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 What's this? Wait, is this fake? Is this, oh. is this not a real bike? This is. is so that, isn't that where you put like the gas? Well, I think so. Do you see where the keys go? I don't even see a, a slot for any keys. This is so weird. Yeah, there's like nothing to start it. Well, I guess it's not going to start anyway since there's no gas in here. Darn it. That's really dusty. I was really excited to try this motorcycle out, guys. All right, well, well, we'll figure out what these keys do eventually. Wow. Look at this big tanker over here. I don't know if this is filled with gasoline or natural gas or something. Huh. It's <laughs> probably empty. What? Pair of shades. Weird, so someone's been around here. They look oh. really dirty. They're broken too. Oh no, maybe they're in trouble. Maybe. Sounds empty though. Should I take my ninja weapons and open it up? I better not, you never know if this thing might, uh, who knows. <laughs> Keep your eyes peeled if you see any clues. We're looking for a person whose name starts with J, maybe has a beard. I have a feeling that it might be the hacker or there might be another YouTuber who's trying to stop the hacker. Not sure. Yeah, just a lot of a lot of old farm equipment. It's all rusted out, like an engine here. There's a lever. It says witty over here. Witty? Witty both ways. Oh. That's kind of cryptic, because it's yeah. like there's both ways. And like T is in the center. I don't know, maybe this is a combination for one for like a padlock or something. Yeah. 
Well, this looks like an old outhouse. Back in the day, people didn't have bathrooms in their house. They had their bathrooms outside their houses. B, you need to go to the bathroom? Uh, no thanks. What? You don't like to go to the bathroom outside? No. Actually, when you grew up in Vietnam, wasn't your bathroom outside? Yes, it was, but I'm in America now, so I don't do that anymore. Oh, <laughs> Mrs. Fancy Pants here. Doesn't go to the bathroom outside anymore. Oh, oh, oh my God. look at this. It's a double outhouse. Two people could go to the bathroom at the same time. V, you and I could be sitting on the toilets together. Oh, how romantic. Yeah. Whoa, look at this thing. Oh. Okay. Uh, look at that. So we can't drive it anywhere. No. Then maybe, maybe we could dig something up. Mm -hmm. It's got this huge digging contraption. Maybe there's like buried treasure here or something. If we can operate this and dig a hole, maybe there's some clues under here. You wanna try it, V? Yeah, let's climb up there. You know how to operate this thing, V? Yeah, I mean, pedals. You got some pedal, wow. pedals down there? Clutch, probably. Yeah? Gas. Oh, those keys, V. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get the key out. Yep, I got them right here. I knew these keys would come in handy. Oh, jeez. Does it fit? Oh. Is, oh it, is it turning? Turning a little bit. Whoa. But it, it's, let me try the other one. Okay. Huh, it turns. No, it turns, but... it doesn't start. No. Huh, okay, so I guess this isn't gonna turn on. Darn, I was really hoping there'd be some treasure in there. Yeah, I know, to be digging something up. <laughs> yeah, that would be fun. All right, it's coming down. Whoa, look at this big container, guys. Huh, remember on the cassette tape that j -Person said, help, help, I'm here. What if that person is trapped in here? <gasps> Hello? Anybody in there? Jay? Jay? Jones? Ja? James? Look at this, there's a lot. Oh, it's another combination. Number combination. Oh, what was that number again? We need to keep an eye out for numbers, guys, as we're investigating this place. If you see any numbers, write some comments down below. I'm gonna try that 1876 again. Yeah, that's that's the year that this town was made. Oh. What's, what's that noise, Dave? Is that me? Yeah, it's coming from your back pocket. What? What? What is that? You hear that beeping? Yeah. <gasps> it's my Tesla. What, what, the alarm's going the off? The alarm's going off. What the heck? What? Why? That's really weird. Yeah, I mean, I got an alert and really, really scary. Was someone trying to steal it or mess with it? Is there anything wrong with the car? I hope they didn't put some sort of device on the car to like track us or something. Is there anything what? around a car? Is anything so wrong? Someone must have been messing with this. What? Get my ninja weapon okay. ready just in case someone's out here. I don't see anything suspicious with the car. Guys, did you see anything suspicious? Did you see anybody? Leave a comment down below. Let us know. I mean, I just feel, you know, you get that feeling like in the back of your neck like your hair stands up like someone's watching that's what i feel right now v just make sure the door's locked and i think you should put that key like on your belt or something so it's really secure okay so it's locked all right i'm keeping it right here you guys can see it just to make sure oh look at this corn chad huh whoa someone ate the whole thing whoa oh don't touch it wow some animals been here eating this corn or could be a human. Oh. Maybe Jay. Maybe like a pond monster? Okay, this gives me a good idea. I can test out these ninja weapons. I haven't tested these out yet. I wanna see how sharp they are. Ah, jeez. A little close to your face there, yeah. B. I'm gonna chop this corn in half. See how sharp this baby is. See if it'll protect us against who's ever here. Ready, three, two, one, karate. Oh. Okay, that's a, I mean, it's a pretty tough corn, but uh, it's definitely a sharp sword, so. V, I thought you were gonna freak out, like, don't eat it, don't eat it. You wanna eat it? No. No? No. <gasps> Look, you guys over there, a little lizard on the rock. Oh, maybe there's a clue in his mouth, a note or something. <laughs> Very slow, otherwise he'll get scared. He's not moving. Is that a baby pond monster? Oh my gosh, is there a pond around here? Maybe the pond used to be down that rock over there. Maybe. It oh, there he goes. There he goes. Oh. He's fast. Chad, you have one of these push pins. What? On your shoe. What the heck? Can you pull it out? What? How? Oh man, I'm glad that. Didn't oh. Go. I'm glad I got thick shoes and that didn't go into my foot. That would have really hurt. Look, it's all rusted and everything. That's really dangerous. That is. Would have had to get a tetanus shot or something after that. Yeah. What happened here? Whoa! Wow! The fence is totally bent, and this is a metal fence. Someone really strong was able to bent this. Whoa! Let me let me see. Oh my gosh! 
Yeah, someone really strong must have bent this down. Who, who could have done that? Oh my gosh, do you think it's the hacker? Is the hacker like really huge and strong? A really big person? We think that the hacker has been growing pond monsters. Maybe a pond monster lived here and broke through the fence? Wow, that's scary. Okay, keep your eye out for more clues. Wait, Chad. Yeah. Is this a clue? <gasps> Whoa, check this out. It's a triangle underneath a rock. Oh. You oh, guys yeah. know what a triangle means, right? Oh. You know. Aluminati. Yeah. Wait, 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 look at this, look down here. And then a, a little further on here, there's another rock and a triangle. Oh, V, look. Oh my gosh, there's a whole trail of them. Whoa, look at this. There's a ton of them. They're all over the place. Yeah, maybe there's clues on them? Nothing on that one. This is really scary. It's like, um, what does this remind you of? Like the Hansel and Gretel yeah. or whatever? They're like luring you? Or? Yeah, are we being led into a trap or something or what? Ugh. I'm not seeing anything on them. They're just triangles. That's really weird. Why would there be white triangles out here? Oh, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Look at this one. It says 20 steps north. Okay. Here, V, hold on to that. Okay. Here's another one here. Oh, 10 steps west. Oh, there's another one right here. Oh my gosh, there's an ant on oh, it. Oh, there's a big ant. Uh, Watch out for the ant. Oh, okay. Tunnel left? So these I are... Don't, I don't even see any tunnels around here. Maybe if we follow number one first, this one says one. We'll say 20 steps, we'll go 20 steps north first. Oh, okay, and then you go 20 steps west. Yep. So let's start by going number one here, 20 steps north. Okay, so it's right. like based on the sun. Uh-huh. That's probably north yep, right there. I, I agree. All right, you ready for 20 steps north, V? Yep. All right, one, one two, two, three, four, four five, six, six, seven, seven eight, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, All right. now. Step two is 10 steps West. west. All right, so if this way is north, north this, this way is west. west. Okay, ready? Okay. One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five, six. six. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. We gotta go down this ravine. Whoa, look down there. Oh, man. You guys know I don't like tunnels, <laughs> tarantulas, <laughs> eggs, deleting channels. Oh. All right, let's go down there. Oh, man, it's so steep. Whoa, careful. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, my leg just went super deep into this hole. Whoa. I'm gonna head over to these rocks here. It looks a little more sturdy. This looks so dangerous, Chad. It is dangerous. We can do it. Oh, okay. All right, more rocks down here. Just gonna have to jump down there, I think. Mommy, you can do it. Woo! All right, now. Oh no. We got the two tunnels. What's uh, what's this? What's the slip of paper say? The triangle. All right, the last piece of triangle says tunnel left. Okay. Does that mean? That must like mean your left. That or must my mean left? this one. It's like if I stand like this, this is my right. Oh. But if I stand like this. Yeah. This is my left. Well, I think since we just came down here and we're looking at the tunnels, I think this is the right one to go down. Wait, wait. Do you hear that? It sounds like our car oh just God, started. Oh my car. That's oh, shoot. Alarm. Shoot, let's get up there, quick. Is someone messing with our car again? Come back, come oh back, guys. Stealing our car. Oh man, oh we're, not, we're not gonna catch him. Oh my God. Who the heck was that? Did they really took off with oh. my Tesla? I think I saw, I saw somebody there. I think they were wearing a mask. Guys, did you see anything? Oh my gosh, who was that? I don't know. I, oh, was that the hacker? The car was beating so fast. Oh, I'm I was sorry, like, no. Oh my I gosh. How, how did they steal the car? You've got the key on you. No, yeah. What? What? Where is it? Where? What? It was right here. You guys saw me put it in my key belt right here. My belt. Did, when? It, did it fall out? So, oh my gosh, it must have. Oh man, what do we do now? Our Tesla is stolen. We're no, stuck here. I don't uh, even know what to do. I've never had a car stolen oh, before. Man. I mean, our phones don't have reception out here, so we can't call anybody. Yeah. Oh, I man. mean, should we just go back to the tunnel? Because, I mean, why are there clues going to the tunnel? Yeah, they... maybe the person who stole our Tesla put something in the tunnel. Maybe they set this whole thing up. Oh. There's nothing else we can do, so let's just go ahead to those tunnels. Well, hopefully, this will lead us to an exit out of this abandoned town since we are trapped here. Which one should we go in first? I gotta duck down pretty low. Do you have to duck down me? Not, not really. Oh my gosh. I can just walk straight. This is really spooky. Gosh, all this dust. I hope there's no pond monsters that live down here. It's not that wide. It's so small. Hello. 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 Marco. Hello. <laughs> there's light in the end of the tunnel. 
All right, guys, we're at the end of the tunnel and there's a bunch of rocks, so we're just gonna head towards here. Oh, looks like there's a note right here. Whoa, that's weird. A note at the end of a tunnel? Yeah. Oh gosh, I don't want to touch it. I'm just gonna use my ninja weapon. What? Oh, there's a mouse trap behind it. Oh my it. gosh. That's so weird. Was someone trying to not let you get this note? I'm so glad I used my weapon. Yeah. Have I used my hand? Oh what man. What does it say? What does it say? Wrong tunnel. If you mess up again, you'll never get the Tesla back. What? This so, person took our Tesla on purpose? And so now they're having us go on this wild goose chase looking for clues. Gosh, this person really likes games. Yeah, They're always they messing around with us. This is really annoying. I just want to get the Tesla back and get out of here. I guess they really meant the other tunnel. Yeah. So we'll just go back and then go on the other tunnel then. And we better be really careful because he says if we screw up again, we don't get the Tesla back. We need your help, you guys. So any clue, think about it very carefully before leaving a comment, okay? Yeah. Back to the tunnel. Right, we're back at the tunnels again. We're gonna go on this side this time. This one is actually shorter because I can't uh, stand up straight. You can't. Yeah. Now you know what it's like to be me. <laughs> this one's less dusty too. There's less cobwebs. This definitely is the right tunnel because it's been more traveled. You can tell it's a little cleaner. I wonder if this person has played this game with other people too. I have heard he's been hacking other YouTubers. So maybe other YouTubers have gone down here. Oh. The end of this tunnel is a little different. It's yeah. not rocky like the other one. It oh! Jeez. Whoa, careful. Okay, I think we need to use our ninja weapons here and like cut all these branches down. There we go. There's a pretty good path now. Okay. <laughs> ah! Oh, I found another note, B. Oh no. Uh, hopefully it tells us the location of our Tesla. We can get out of here. Oh man, there's another mouse trap. Oh man, I'm gonna use my finger. It's gonna be really careful to not set this mouse trap off because that would really hurt. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see what this says. I've hidden nine mouse traps with 12 clues. Do not set off any mouse traps to get your Tesla back. And oh. all these little scribbly things. I recognize some of these symbols. They were oh. in the in the vault video. Yeah, they were underneath the mouse traps. Yeah. Oh man, it's the same person playing with us. That's really good because we didn't set off this mouse trap. So our Tesla's safe for now. As long as we don't set off any mouse traps we get our Tesla back. Yeah. Time to explore this abandoned town some more. All right. I just want to get out of here. I know, it's so hot. I'm so thirsty. Well, one place we haven't looked yet is this schoolhouse looking thing right here. Oh, you yeah. guys. We got th right, three mouse traps down here and it looks like pieces of paper on all three of them. I'll just use my ninja spy skills to take them off. You can do it. Come on, V, don't set off that trap. Oh. 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 One down, two to go. Careful! Okay, my turn. There's a bird crowing at me! It's trying to jinx me. Ooh. This, this reminds me of playing like Operation when I was little. Yeah. Let me know in the comment below if you guys have played Operation before. You know what these look like? These look like puzzle pieces. Puzzle oh, pieces? Oh, look on the other side. There's like a picture or something. Oh my gosh! Do they fit together? Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, that goes in there. Oh my gosh, there. this nice. one. That goes in there. This one, I don't think goes anywhere yet. Yeah, we need to find yeah. more pieces. All right, yeah, let's, let's explore some more. Hey, what is that thing? What? Oh, that? Oh. oh, it's a mailbox. I wonder if there's a clue. Careful, there might be a mouse trap in oh, there here, or something. Here. Yeah. All right, just in case. I'm not gonna touch it. What is that? It's dog poop! Oh, oh. It's poop! Who would put poop in a mailbox? Oh, you guys! I feel like we've looked through this whole entire abandoned town. But maybe he put some things while we were not around? Maybe. I mean, we didn't find any clues while we're over here in this little junkyard area. We didn't yet check out these huge tree stumps yet, so maybe we should check those out. If there's any dog poop, I'm gonna chop it up! Ew! Yeah. Oh. Wait, there's a heart! Whoa! What is this? Is this a clue? Maybe it means the hacker loves us. Maybe the hacker just took it and he's getting the car cleaned for us? I highly doubt it. Is there something in this tree stump maybe? It's a really huge tree stump. There's a big hole right in the middle of it. Chad, I actually can't see the bottom of this thing. So you probably have to look inside the stump for me. You need a tall person to look in the stump, huh? Yeah. 
Is there okay. anything? Oh yeah, um, I see something. I see a big green plant in there, but then I also see a mouse trap down there. You guys see that? Guys, give this video a like to wish me good luck so I don't chop my finger off while reaching into this hole. So I'm gonna need good luck. All right, here we go. Be careful, Chad. Hope I can't I, see anything, but hope, be careful. Hope my finger doesn't get chopped. Oh, it's really a tough reach. Oh. oh. Did you get it? Got it, woo! Oh, oh! Oh, gosh! That's four puzzle pieces. Okay, so we need what, like eight more? 12 minus four is eight, yes! Yeah, let's go. Yeah. So we're back here at this big house. I got that weird feeling here last time. Maybe there was someone here and they were playing tricks on us. Okay, this time we're actually gonna try and see if we could get in the house. You know, this is like nailed down or something. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty tight. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I you oh my it. gosh, I thought I had it too. Like my heart heavy. skipped a beat. Gosh, I just got that weird feeling around here again. Right here is where we saw a figure go by these windows. Here, in the back of my neck, start standing up again. And oh gosh, that chair. Last time we were here, this chair was moving. Luckily, it's not moving this time. And this door closed on me, almost hit me in the face. All right, guys, we're back here again. We didn't unlock any of the doors this time, but we're gonna try and unlock them. How about that one, Chad? It still has a padlock on it. This one doesn't have a lock still. Huh. I'm gonna, try, I'm gonna try a combination for this one right here. I'm gonna try to <laughs> what? 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 What happened? Chad! What? I felt someone touch me. Did you do it? No, I was by the door the whole time. No, I felt something. I felt something or someone sure touch my hair. Maybe it was a bug crawling on you or something? Did something fall on me? Anything on the ceiling? Are you playing a trick on me, Chad? No, I was over there trying to padlock. I mean, I didn't see you over there. Are you sure? B, I was over there the whole time. Okay, you guys, I definitely felt something. You guys need to comment down below. Let me know if you actually saw Chad and if you saw someone here also. Comment down below right now. Guys, let her know that it wasn't me. I'm not walking by that chair. You think it was the chair? I don't know, we keep seeing these random empty chairs and it's creeping me out. Just to be safe. Nothing here. I guess if it was a ghost, it'd probably go through the ghost anyway, so. Uh, what's in that fridge? Anything? In there. Oh, come look at this. Check uh, it out, there's more mouse traps and more puzzle pieces in here. It's way back there, Chad. It's gonna be hard to reach because they're flipped around in reverse. It's this water bottle again. It's like freshly drank. Is Jay setting this up? Oh, what is this? Chapsticks. Oh, I know how to use this. Oh, I can use these to wrap the puzzle pieces. Then you won't hurt your fingers. Yeah. Okay. All right, you can do it, B. Wait, you can I, do it. I'm not eating. I don't know. I always just do this whenever I see chopsticks. You All can right. do this. Be careful. Oh my gosh. Be careful. Oh. Because if you set off another mouse trap, we don't get the Tesla. That's why you have to be very careful. If one goes off, the note said that we don't get it. Oh. Oh. Careful. No. Oh. Oh, I was like not even breathing. Okay. I'm gonna close this very carefully so I don't set the mouse traps off. All right, three more puzzles. Three more puzzle pieces. So that okay. means we've got four plus three. We've got seven so far. Yeah, and we need 12. All right. Oh, just a few more and then we're done, you guys. Hang in there with us. Oh. You know, we never did look at any of these sheds right around here. Oh yeah, let's check out this one. Yeah. Okay, this one's got a padlock on it with another okay. combination. Okay, I'm gonna try that 1873 or 76? 1876, yeah. When we first got here, guys, in the last video, we saw that this town was built in 1876. 1876. No. Oh, no. Okay, let's try this other shed right over here. Oh, this padlock has letters instead of numbers. Oh. Four letter word. What can we spell with four letters? Maybe it's a four letter word that starts with J? Oh my gosh, you guys should leave a comment down below what you think the password should be. You think it's Jake? Could be Josh, Jack. Matt from Matthias. He's got a beard. While you guys are leaving a comment below, let's, let's investigate if there's another way inside this little shed here. Oh, whoa, whoa. this window's open. What's in here? There's, there's mouse traps down in here. There's no way that I'm gonna fit in this little hole. V, I think I'm gonna have to hoist you up. That's my ninja skills. Yeah, being small comes in handy. All right, you wanna step on my knee first? All right, ready? ready? One, two, three. three. Okay. Oh my God. Oh. Hi, drop. Careful. Watch out for the glass. Ah! Oh, okay. 
I'm in, you guys. What do you see in there, V? I see three mouse traps here. So I'm gonna be really careful and just remove them. So there's really dangerous glass here. Yeah, if you set the mouse trap off and the glass goes flying, ooh. I'm gonna do it. Careful. Go for that one first. Careful, careful. I got it. Oh, oh. oh. oh man. I, just, I got a little too excited there. Okay. Oh, you're gonna use that one to yeah. get it off? No, you set one off. <laughs> now what? Do we not get the Tesla now? Crap. Maybe, maybe he won't find out we set it off. Maybe if we get all the puzzle pieces quick enough, oh he gosh. won't know you set it off. Oh my gosh. I was just trying to flick it off, you guys. Oh, all right, okay. don't, don't set the other one off. Okay. Uh, don't set it off. <gasps> okay, now what? What do I do with this? Pull it out. Wow, good, uh, good thing it was a puzzle piece and not your finger. Oh my gosh, yeah. I hope he doesn't find out. Yeah, we need to find the other ones quickly before, oh before he finds out. Okay, all right, I'm gonna get out of here. All right. You got this. Uh, yeah. let's, let's hurry up and try to find the other one yeah. so the hacker does not find. Yeah, we gotta hurry. Find out. We are back to the beginning. We've explored everything, found so many mouse traps, but I feel like we need two more. You know, we actually never did go in this pen. I think this is like a horse pen right here. Oh, oh, it's open. And it opens. Maybe this is where the final clues will be. This is a very low shed. Like, I can touch the ceiling. Also, maybe, like, really small animals live here. Let's see how low it is. Oh, just kidding. That was my hand. <laughs> see, that's why I, did, I think you're the one that touched my hair earlier. It, was, it wasn't me. Guys, comment. Let her know it was not me. I did not touch her He's hair. He's always playing tricks like that. Anyways, let's just look for the mouse traps because I want to get out of here. I want my Tesla back. Let me know if you guys see anything. Anything on the ground? No, I'm not seeing anything on the ground. Try not to hit my head up here. Speaking of not hitting my head, look what I just found. A mouse trap way up here. It's on there very loosely. Don't set it off, Jay. Go, shabam. We need one more. Oh gosh. It's gotta be in here. Whoa, what's this place right wow, here? Wow, look how creepy that looks. Look at all these holes. Are these bullet holes? Oh no. If we go in here, our bullet's gonna shoot out? Were people trying to escape? Whoa, 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 whoa. <gasps> whoa. Oh geez. It's really unstable around here. I just, I'm just, i just gonna get off. Are you doing balance beam over here? Okay. This is the biggest mouse trap I have ever seen in my life. Look how huge this is. There's a bunch of small ones set all around it. That's gotta be the final puzzle piece. I think this is the 12th one. I, I don't think I wanna get that with my fingers. I'm pretty sure that huge rat trap is gonna break a finger if that thing goes off. Yeah, up. I'm gonna use my chopsticks. I've got a light here for you. Okay. All right, I'm gonna try not to set this one off. Yeah, don't set off this one. Oh my gosh, it's huge. It's gonna hurt. Careful. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. What? There you go. Oh, I think I'm... Grab it. Oh, okay. Don't All set right. off the other one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, why? It's way over there now. Come on. Come on. I thought you liked to eat Asian food. Oh my gosh. Why? I'm just so nervous. There you go. Okay. That's right. our 12th puzzle piece. My Asian card <laughs> is still intact. Let's put these pieces together, huh? All right, yeah, let's go somewhere. There's a lot of light. Let's put this puzzle together. Yeah, do it right here where it's flat? Yeah. Okay. Uh. Let's see. All right. Okay, what's this puzzle gonna tell us, you think, V? Uh, I feel like it's a picture of somewhere around here. Yeah. It looks familiar. Oh, one last piece of the puzzle. Here it is. Oh my gosh, what and is where, it? Where is this? What is this? I see hay. I see, oh, it's like oh, it's a like metal a shed. Trees. Wait a second. This, this looks like, I feel like I've seen this. Yeah, when we first were driving here, we drove by this on the way in. Yeah. Wait, is that where our Tesla is? It was big enough to fit a car in it. Let's hurry because. Yeah, because you set up a mousetrap. I want to get my Tesla back. Hurry, hurry. 
Yes. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. This is definitely the same place that was in the puzzle. Do you think it's big enough to fit a Tesla in it? Definitely, I think our Tesla's behind there. Can you see? No, nothing, nothing in here. That door doesn't open. Let's check this other door. Okay. What? What? Uh, this... This is not my Tesla. Is, our Tesla's not red and it, it's not that small. Why is it small? Oh no. Uh-oh. Is it because one of the mouse traps got set off? Uh, he decided not to give us our Tesla. He gave us a mini Tesla. I want my Tesla, Chad. Uh, I just got it. Man. Well, what does this mean? I don't know. Let's, let's bring it outside. All right. Uh, so what exactly are we supposed to do with this? I mean, I'm small, but I can't drive with this. Does it drive? Could it take us home? There's a gas pedal in here. There is? Oh, oh my gosh, it actually moves. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it drives. Oh my gosh, I can actually fit in here. Whoa, you fit in there. I didn't think you would. drive home, V. I guess I'll just have to run home. Yeah, let's check it out. Maybe there's a clue in here or something. There's one of these auxiliary thing. Oh, you can plug in your phone maybe. Oh, there's, there's, a trunk. The trunk? there's a trunk back here. Let's see what's in this trunk here. Does it open? Well, a battery. A s wait, wait. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Not another I note. Can't. Oh, oh, no. Guys, you won't believe what this note says. 